guys, Oscar here for Nautic Rouge, and I want to show you really quick a, uh, a website where we need to edit the menu items. And some people call them the menu tabs or the tabs at the top. Um, so let me show you the problem. It's not so much a problem as just a change in configuration. So we have this website here, and we have five menu items at the top. Some people call them menu tabs or tabs, whatever, whatever you want to call them. And ideally, you want to have three to four at most because it changes the amount of traffic that you get to certain pages the more items you have up there. So you want to have as few as possible that are very purposeful. And we've just added a new page to the site that needs to be up here. So the first two that you can move down somewhere else, for example, all the way down here, our contact, which we've already done in a previous uh, case, and about. Now, why can you move contact and about down to the bottom? It's because people know to look for an about page. The search engines always index it. It's the second most visited page on every site. And contact is something that you want to avoid to some degree to minimize spam and unsolicited requests but if somebody really needs to get a hold of you they will scroll down to look for a contact form like this one or for a contact link like this one below so we can get rid of those two and so in this case we're going to move the about page down below and we're going to add the new page we already created the page let's find it here and it's called media we, co we created a media page and in order to edit the menus, we're going to go to the Appearance and Menus section in WordPress. This is, if your website was built correctly, this is where you're going to find your menus. Under Menus, you will see here the different menus that you, are available to you. So first, in the main navigation menu, we're going to remove the About page. So we're going to remove About and to demonstrate this, if we click on Save Menu, we'll go back to the home page and refresh, you'll see there's no longer an About page. Okay. We're also going to add it to the footer. So we're going to select the footer menu, and you see that there's Sitemap, Stores, Cookies, and Contact. And those are the same that are down here, Sitemap, Store, Cookies, and Contact. So we're going to add About page here. So we're going to look for the About. Add it to the menu and we're just going to put it right in the beginning then we're going to go back to the main navigation menu select that oh let's make sure we save okay we've saved this one now let's go back to the main navigation menu select that and Here's our most recent page, which is the media, and we're going to click on Add to Menu. And in this case, I believe it is most important right here under Media. Well, maybe right here after Portfolio. Now, the priority of the pages is totally up to you, but this is how you manipulate menu items on a WordPress page. If you are curious, I am using WordPress with Elementor, and I'll have the links down below. So now you see the media page here, and if we click on it, of course, it's going to take us there, and it's all created and ready to go. So anyway, that's it. If you have any questions about WordPress, Elementor, hosting, marketing, anything like that, please let me know. My contact information is all over the internet, or you can just go to notagrouch.com forward slash contact. Thanks for watching. Talk to you later.